A drivable red desk telephone. It, it's always a double take when people see it. Bought an old car and uh, stripped it down to the wheels and started building uh, a telephone from the ground up and it, it, uh, it endured as one of the ten most unique cars in the world. I've been collecting phones since I was nine years old and uh, never stopped. It's built on a 1975 Volkswagen Beetle. The reactions are great because people, when they see it driving down the street, recognize the object as being a telephone. And then the double take is, my goodness, it's driving. Wait a second, <laughs> something's not right here. It has turn signals, it has all the, all the safety features. You know, everything that, everything that a regular car would have except that when you uh, blow the horn, it rings. It doesn't beep, it rings. I drive it around town, um, especially around the holidays. I've gone, gone uh, cross country several times. It, it really is a lot of fun. Um, when you take it out, it's just nothing but smiles and laughs and waves from people. So I, I, I do enjoy it very much. People used to have very unique cars, you know, back in the 50s and the early 60s, and then everything got very plain and very mundane. So to be able to drive around with a uh, with a giant telephone is a lot of fun.